A synagogue in California honored one of the hostages taken by Hamas. He was one of six hostages found dead this week in a tunnel in Gaza. Kevin Coe reports. It was standing room only at Congregation Beth Israel for a memorial honoring Hirsch Goldberg Poland, the 23-year-old Israeli-American who was taken hostage by Hamas on October 7th. He was one of six hostages found dead this week in a tunnel in Gaza. President Joe Biden says all were killed by Hamas. Completely heartbreaking and crushing. There is profound grief and mourning in this community. Yonatan Cohen is the rabbi at Congregation Beth Israel, where Goldberg Poland uttered his first prayers. Our tradition in times of uh, pain and loss teaches us to go deep into the pain, not to ignore it, but actually to create greater space for it. And that's what we're doing tonight. Um, really creating a sacred vessel to hold the tears. Tears were shed by many, including those who saw themselves in Goldberg, Poland, like Jonathan Mincer with the Bay Area's Jewish Community Relations Council. He was a, a, young, a young guy who loved music and sports. He was trying to bring people together for a pathway forward for peace. So this is his legacy, and this is the way we want to remember him. Memorial attendees wrote messages to Goldberg, Poland before praying and hearing from those who know the Goldberg Poland family. We know from knowing John and Rachel, their strength will still be there, and Hirsch's memory will be for a blessing. Hirsch, 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 do you have any idea how many people love you? Worshippers tell me Goldberg Poland was a symbol of hope to them, hope for the return of the hostages in Hamas captivity and hope for the end of the bloodshed. But now, Goldberg, Poland is gone, and the conflict continues. For many of us, we've been living in a period in which we often feel like our pain is not seen. And I can imagine that uh, those who stand on the other side might feel that way too. And I think we need to take a moment to acknowledge people's pain. We need to insist on, on hope and on faith. That is something that was important to Hirsch. And that was something that was important with his parents. And we cannot let that die with Hirsch.